Jesus solved the problem of sin so that we could be saved. Here's what it's all about. God's promise of salvation so that we can be saved. God sent his one and only son, Jesus, to deal with the problem of sin. Everyone who has ever lived and anyone who will ever live has what is called sin. Sin separates us from God. Jesus died on the cross, taking punishment for sin so that we could be rescued from it and have a relationship with God, our Heavenly Father. Sin separates us from God. We all sin. None of us are perfect. Adam and Eve, the very first two people God created were together with him in the Garden of Eden. Adam and Eve were given the freedom to make their own choices. God gave them one rule. It was not to eat from a certain tree in the garden. They disobeyed God and made a choice to do the wrong thing. Adam and Eve were then separated from God. Let's say this water is your life. When we are born into this world, we sin. We do wrong things against God. Since Adam and Eve disobeyed, they had to face the consequences of a life without a relationship with God. Sin separates us from God, but Jesus is the answer. Jesus is what washes us clean from our sin. Let's say this pepper is sin in your life. It's dirty, it's nasty, it keeps us from having a relationship with God. God is so holy, he can't be close to sin. He is so perfect, we can't have a relationship with him unless we know Jesus as our Lord and Savior. When we accept Jesus as our Lord and Savior, we are washed clean from our sins. So there's only one thing that can separate us from God, and that is sin. And there is only one person who can bring us together with God, and that is Jesus. Romans 10.9 says, Say with your mouth, Jesus is Lord. Believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, then you will be saved. God's promise is that you will be saved. The verse doesn't say you might be saved or you could be saved if you're good enough. God's promise is that you will be saved and God keeps his promises. Romans 10 13 says, everyone who calls on the name of the Lord will be saved. Everyone who calls on the name of Jesus, everyone. God's promise is to everyone. It's only through Jesus that we can be saved. He is the only way. When we choose to follow Jesus and believe that he died and rose again, we can have new life and we will be saved. Call on his name. Jesus solved the problem of sin so that we can be saved. Think of our lives like this nice, white, fresh, nutritious milk. We might think we're pretty good people and we mostly do the right thing. The truth is that none of us are perfect. We all have things in our lives that mess stuff up. We might get a bit selfish and only think about ourselves. We might disobey our parents or teachers. Pretty soon, we find that all this other stuff gets mixed up in our life. drink this. Not me. Maybe we can try to make it better by adding some more milk. Let's see. It's overflowing, it's overflowing. <laughs> <laughs> so gross. I was trying to tell you. <laughs> Trash can. <laughs> I was going. Right. The truth is, adding more fresh milk won't help. This milkshake needs a fresh start. God promises a fresh start. 
We can't remove the bad stuff from here on our own. This problem of sin needs an answer, and the answer is Jesus. God promises that when we turn to Jesus, we can have a fresh start. Jesus solved the problem of sin so you and me can be saved.